And families forced out by a grass fire now returning to their homes. They say they're feeling extremely blessed to still have a roof over their heads. Officials say two men adding on to a home in Belvedere's neighborhood accidentally started the fire yesterday with a welding torch. It's a new upscale community off Hamilton Pool Road in western Travis County. Our Aaron Cargyle has been out there all morning and now brings us the details. Good afternoon. This is our first time to have access to this gated community since the fire started. Check out how close the flames got to the front door of these million dollar homes. This electric box right here that sits on the edge of their property completely burned. The cables melted and right next door. Look at this. This empty lot is for sale. It is entirely burned. Here's how firefighters are spending their day driving around targeting hot spots still smoking. Now take a look again at this frightening video from last night. A bright orange glow lit up the dark sky. The good news, those flames were moving away from the neighborhood. By sunset, firefighters had the fire stopped thanks to low winds. Flames didn't spread any further overnight. Now the portion that's still smoldering is almost completely out. With no home to stay in last night, most of the 60 families found a place to stay. The Red Cross served dinner for about 80 people last night at the neighborhood community center. They also escorted some folks back to their homes last night around 11 so they could get medications and pets since a lot of people were at work yesterday when the fire started. Two families slept on the floor in the community center last night. When everybody's able to go back home and their houses are fine and the worst that happens is they've lost their cable TV for a few days, I think they're going to feel like they're pretty lucky here. The fire department is also praising the homeowners out here, saying their landscaping is exactly how it should be. Take this house, for example. Their grass is extremely short, and you do not see brush right up to the side of the house. If that were the case, it would be even more fuel for the fire. Now, also, at 1 o'clock this afternoon, the Texas Forest Service will be flying over from above, surveying the damage. In western Travis County, Aaron Cargyle, KXAN News.